The RC2 is your vaccine central with the latest information about the COVID-19 vaccine. Texas Children's Hospital now administering Pfizer's lower dose COVID vaccine to kids ages 5 to 11. This is video of some of those kids getting their shots just this morning. Children will get one third the amount of medicine given to adults in two doses three weeks apart. And we continue our coverage right now with KPRC2's Brittany Jeffers. He's joining us live with more on how pharmacies are handling the vaccinations to this younger age category. Brittany, good morning. Hey, good morning to you. Well, we found out that pharmacies like CVS and Walgreens have opened up appointments. You can go online to schedule that even on your phone. Uh, but keep in mind that they will not be administering those shots until this weekend. So there's a lot of options out there. Some families tell us that they're ready to sign up while others are a little more hesitant. Pick a date and a time. Parents with kids ages 5 to 11 can now schedule appointments to receive the Pfizer COVID-19 vaccination. Appointments already stacking up at Texas Children's Hospital. As of uh, this morning, we have over 30,000 kids signed up. As of this morning, pharmacies are also taking appointments. Representatives with Walgreens tell me they'll begin administering those shots on Saturday, while CVS says they will give them out on Sunday. Some Houstonians say they're ready. This is science and we have always believed in science and we will always believe in science. So kids as much as much as the adults should take the vaccines as well. But not everyone's on board. Um, I'm a little skeptical. Jennifer Berger says she won't be making an appointment anytime soon for her six year old. I'm real protective of my little one so I don't want him to get like a bad reaction to it or anything like that. I know it's a health concern you know so he doesn't get other kids sick or other kids get him sick. But I'm a little iffy about it just because of all the side effects that, you know, elderly or older people have have gotten. A survey by the Kaiser Family Foundation shows 73% of parents have similar reservations. They say they will not vaccinate their children right away, citing questions about expedited testing protocols and even potential side effects. Although some pediatricians are pushing back on that concern. We have the best scientists in the country who are reviewing this data, who are reviewing it independently. Uh, and, and if all goes the way that we expect it, will show us that the benefit of vaccination outweighs is the risk. Now, something else to note on the pharmacy end of things here. Representatives with Walgreens tell me that families can also have their children ages 5 to 11 receive a flu shot when they receive that COVID-19 vaccination. Reporting live from the Med Center and Brittany Jeffers, KPRC 2 News. Brittany, thank you.